Dr. Newman is a surgical oncologist, professor of surgery, and director of the Breast Care Center for the University of Michigan in Ann Arbor, Michigan. As an African-American female surgeon, Dr. Lisa Newman is a rarity in the United States. African-Americans make up less than 5% of physicians in this country. If there weren't any doctors in my family. I just used to watch a lot of General Hospital with my mom during the day when I was in grade school and the idea of working in a hospital and practicing medicine piqued my interest. My career took a lot of uh, twists and turns over the years. I actually started out once I finished medical school practicing general surgery, but what I found really interesting was in looking at the diverse patient population of Brooklyn, we were seeing a lot of breast cancer being diagnosed in very young African-American women. That was when I decided to focus my career on uh, surgical oncology and ultimately surgical breast oncology with the study of disparities. One of the things that became apparent is that uh, African American women are more likely to be diagnosed with estrogen receptor negative breast cancer compared to white American women. So the triple negative breast cancers are the tumors that are negative for all three markers. And what we have since learned is that uh, African American women are also at substantially higher risk for being diagnosed with these triple negative breast cancers. The vast majority of the advances that we have made in conquering these life-threatening aspects of breast cancer have been advances that do not work for the triple negative breast cancers. And so for the triple negative breast cancers, the field is wide open. In seeing that the triple negatives affect African American women twice as frequently as they affect white American women with breast cancer, it's uh, motivated us to pursue international studies trying to understand these triple negative breast cancers. Investigating the role of genetics may unlock the mystery of why African American women have higher rates of triple negative tumors and thus help all patients. As a researcher, Dr. Newman collaborates with doctors at the Kamfu Anoki Teaching Hospital in Kamasi, Ghana in hopes of discovering the origins of triple negative breast cancer. Close to three quarters of the breast cancers that we see in Ghanaian women are triple negative. About 40% of the breast cancers that we see in African American women are triple negative. This research is imperative. Women, young women around the world are disproportionately dying from triple negative breast cancers every day. Newman is convinced there's a profound link between Ghanaian women and African-American women. To test her theory, she runs DNA comparisons from African-American women to samples gathered in Ghana, and one day hopes to correlate African ancestry with the risk of being diagnosed with triple negative breast cancer in African-Americans. It is a tragedy of monumental proportions that women with triple negative breast cancers are left with all of the same treatments that were available several decades ago. And that's not true for any of the other cancers. She'll tell you her story, but she was diagnosed with breast cancer several years ago. She's done wonderfully, wonderfully. And when she was diagnosed, her daughter, Frankie, who took it on herself to really be um, extremely active, uh, invested in the breast health awareness uh, program. She's a joy. First of all, she's absolutely fabulous, and anybody that looks at her knows that she's got it all. It's a great package. God did not short her at all. I started out having pains in my breast, not knowing who to go to, but I found Dr. Newman. And Dr. Newman said, your mother has breast cancer, but we're going to fight this, and we're going to win. And if you call her, she's going to find a way if she's out of town. It's like having a birthday cake, and you thank God that she's there for you. I wake up every day thinking that I have the greatest job in the world. <laughs> I, I do, and uh, every day is gratifying. Yeah, some days are more challenging than others. Some days have more heartbreak in them than other days, but uh, they are all days filled with passion, excitement, and, and hope. Dr. Lisa Newman is a brilliant and compassionate clinician and researcher. 
dedicated to unraveling the perplexing question of how racial disparity impacts triple negative breast cancer patients. For this reason and many more, the Triple Negative Breast Cancer Foundation is proud to bestow the 2012 Peace, Love and Cure Hero Award upon Dr. Lisa Newman.